Round two, game two on Thursday night. Abbotsford leads Toronto one nothing in their Calder Cup series. First period, Will Acton sits down Pierre Luc Laterno LeBlond. A nice hit behind Abbotsford's net, but it's the Heat that strike first. Scriven stops Roman Horak and Ben Walter, but John Rowe bangs the rebound home. A messy one, 10 minutes in, puts the heat up 1-0. From that point on, though, all Marley's on the power play. Nazem Kadri down low to Ryan Hamilton. Spins and tucks it past Danny Taylor. The EA Sports L2 move ties it at 1. Two minutes later, Jerry D'Amigo grabs the loose puck and breaks in on Danny Taylor. But the tender flashes the pad, one of his 24 saves. Keeps us even until this. Matt Fratton, 23 seconds to go, pumps the Joe Sackick wrist shot past Taylor. 2-1 Marlies into the second period where they only add to the feast. Corbinian holds her slap shot, stopped, and a diving D'Amigo shoves it home. Sheer desperation. That's what they'd say in soccer. More from Holzer. Mike Zagomanis works the corner and feeds the D-man. This time his blast blows right by Taylor. 4-1 Marley's 24 minutes in. Abbotsford now shorthanded. Marley's give it away and Paul Byron in alone on Scrivens is stopped. One of Scrivens' 37 saves. Toronto badly outshot in this one. Then some rough stuff. Toronto's Greg Scott gets taken out and then he takes out the knee of Ben Walter. Kind of a nasty sequence. Walter down at center ice. Scott gets Five for kneeing and a game misconduct. Now with nine to go, Abbotsford pulls Taylor and Nazem Kadri sinks the empty netter. 5-1 Marlies, it's over, folks. Although some fireworks between the policeman and the fireman. Same as how game one ended just over a minute to go. Will Acton gets a penalty shot. Yeah, because that'll put it out of reach. Danny Taylor, the nice dolphin save. Looks like Luongo. But Toronto wins this thing's even at one game apiece. Abbey loses their first game in the playoffs. Series shifts to Abbotsford for Saturday, 7 p.m. Pacific. Colby Selinski for Black Press. Abbotsford.